the bus. How's it going? We are Hollywood ending. Um, so I'm Chris, Dan. Um, do you want to see where we're living over the past like two months? On the road? Let's go. We try to keep it as clean as possible. You know, you go on through this way. And you get very fashionable Snuggie right here. This is mine, it's a penguin Snuggie. And then uh, if I show you my bunk, right here on the floor, um, sometimes I'll take this hoodie and I'll put it down and that's my pillow. It's actually really comfortable and then the floor yeah. has a lot of like leg room and place for me to spread out. It's, it's a very comfortable bunk. I there's there's assigned sleeping arrangements. Basically, Mikey, it's his van, so he gets his own row. This is Mikey's row. The driver, our tour manager, me and Dan share this row. We rotate. Sometimes I'll sleep on the floor, sometimes Dan will sleep on the floor. We like to use like the crisp packets. They're like the pillows and insulation because our driver insists on driving with the window down and the heating's really bad in the van. This is pretty much where we've been living. I know that Tyler and Dan like to make a fort back here. Right here, see. Like it. we'll get under it and the heat van is like right there. So like when it's really cold out and we're in like zero degree weather, Colorado. we just go under the blanket and this keeps yeah. us warm. And we like sometimes can peg it up here, you know, like make it like... Yeah, sometimes things. we make our forts like that so no one can see the back and we're like in a totally different view. Yeah, we're all about the forts in Hollywood ending. Yeah. Um, I mean, in other news, we have Coco. <laughs> He's been with us since, um, I think, a couple weeks ago now. So we just like, we have to find bears from homes in the van or so. You might find him scared around it. <laughs> we brought him into the family. I mean, it was a tough decision, but we just like to adopt and save the world yeah. one bear at a time. And you know, we're not strictly speaking about American bears, we're also going to like Canadian bears and stuff, we've got British bears in the van. We don't discriminate with bears, we, yeah. we'll take any bear you want to give us. <laughs> um, what else we got? Okay. Underwear, okay, let's, Underwear. let's not even look at that. Yes. A bandana, which is also used as like a tablecloth, so like maybe like a windows now. Um, I mean... Basically, clothes are scattered yeah. everywhere. We just like we're all about the insulation. We just have like a thousand blankets. Most of the time, if we don't want them, we just chuck them back to Cameron's row. Cameron's very much isolated in the back row. Um, we don't really see Cameron or hear from him on the long journeys. Now, um, we're not actually allowed to sit up here in the front. This is reserved for our driver and the tour manager. And also, me and Chris are the two members of the band that couldn't drive an American car. Yeah. Because I don't have my license. And he's steering wheel on the other side. <laughs> Well, you know, it's not good to come up here and pretend like we're driving the van. Yeah. I mean, we just like, we can hang out. I mean, we actually found some more characters along the way. It's company the bears. This is uh, Mr. Giggles, named after our driver, Redneck Matt. Yeah. He uh, always tweets about me. Yeah. He keeps him company when doing long drives. When Redneck Matt drives for the night, he doesn't get many, like, any conversation to keep him going. I think Mr. Giggles is the, almost like Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. He um, guides him through the night when he's in, it, when he's in town. Um, we also have some other cuddly little friends over here. Some woodland critters. Um, here we go. Just to keep like, you know, feng shui very nice in the van. We like to be in positive moods, isn't that right? Yeah, it is right. Positive. Positivity is key on the road. Um, it also reminds us of some of the roadkill, but we don't want to talk about that. All right, so here is our trailer. It's actually pretty cool. This whole wall right here is sectioned off, so we have one section for all the gear. Merchandise. And then one section for yeah. our merch and luggage. It's our extended wardrobe. Exactly. And um, I know that Tyler has the biggest wardrobe. I think uh, he has like two big suitcases. Tyler brought a suitcase full of 40 packs of socks. Yeah. He so also he has, has a suitcase for socks. I think he has three suitcases. He has one suitcase dedicated to shoes. Now, now he's one for socks, and then he has his hanger right here. So he gets to hang out by blazers, you jackets, that Tyler's, That's the only thing hanging. That's Tyler's. Yeah, we don't really hang stuff. Like, I only brought two pairs of socks on the whole tour, and like, right now I'm like mixed matching, you know, I don't have the same pair on. Uh, but Tyler loves his socks. Um, what else? We have, um, Cameron skateboard. Sometimes we pull up and we think, uh, what's there to do at a venue? Let's go skate. We can't really do anything around here, but... Yeah, it's kind of hard to do it on gravel, but... We like to skate. Uh, I have my baby. Oh. This, this guitar. Chris just got this guitar the other day. It's, it's called Darby. Oh. <laughs> Basically. It's just a really nice, small acoustic guitar that we take to house parties and stuff. Everyone thinks it's like a child starter guitar because it's so small. Yeah. It's easy, just portable, take it out, play anywhere, write a song in the van. This is also the quarantine yeah, area. Like when our driver gets mad at one of us, like when we don't let us sit in the bus. Oh yeah, we get sent to the back and we sit in the trailer. 
So sometimes I just It's like time out, it's like detention. How about this? <laughs> this would pay me. Oh. You sit back here and play this guitar. But to be honest, there's not a lot else in the van. Most of the time we just pass the time by sleeping because we're so tired. Yeah. We live very simple lives on the road. Well guys, thanks so much for stopping by our van and chair. Hope you enjoyed the tour. Um, check out our other videos, check us out on Twitter, Facebook, Facebook YouTube, all, all that, that good stuff. stuff. Jeez, that was so weird! But anyways, yeah. hope you don't think we're weird and gross because you saw our trash. Um, we're actually very clean human beings. We shower once a day, every day. Yeah. We brush our teeth every day, twice a day. Sometimes three times. Depends if, if I have Subway and I want to brush my teeth again. Yeah. But, thank you for Peace. checking it out. See you guys. Blah, 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 blah.